We continue our Thunder at the Glen Race Week coverage brought to you by Williams Toyota of Elmira. Well, it was a beautiful day up at Watkins Glen International with a storybook ending to finish off the night. Today was the Xfinity Series Mission 200 at the Glen, which consists of 82 laps or 200.9 miles full of competition. 18-year-old Connor Zilich made his Xfinity Series debut this afternoon, and just last night he took the checkered flag in the Arca Menards Series race. But he still must have been hungry. The Charlotte, North Carolina na native dominated the entirety of stage one. You can see just how far out in front he is at the beginning. He led every single lap of stage one today. Most of the race was clean, but near the last few miles is where things got a little dicey with 35 laps to go. Zilich and a couple more drivers were penalized after mistakenly taking a shortcut on the course during a caution. NASCAR sending him and two other racers to the back of the field, but he made his way back up to the front. His strategy was to not fuel up again, but with the race going into double overtime, Zilich said he was scared that he wouldn't be able to make it. Lucky for him, the race ended in caution and he was able to come out victorious in his debut, an accomplishment only six drivers have ever done. I mean, just the hard work that I put in, it feels so good for hard work to pay off. And, uh, you know, racing is not always, you know, easy and you're not always going to win. So uh, you got to enjoy these wins when you can. And this one means a lot to me. So I'm um, just glad that I was able to get this opportunity to come out here and show show my talent on a road course. And, um, you know, this one this one's going to be special to me for a long time. With any amount of hard work and, and anything, you know, if you prepare enough for something, anything can happen. And, um, you know, that's truly what, what, what led me to be in this position. And, um, you know, I'll continue to do that next year when I'm racing full time. And, you know, I'm looking forward to the future.